Wall Street thinks things are going pretty well, but uh, not the American people. The University of Michigan's headline sentiment index falls to its lowest since last November, seven months, 65.6 from 69.1, way below the 72 expected. Current conditions fall to 62.5 from 69.6, and expectations fall to 67.6 from 68.8. And Americans did not get the CPI, PPI message this week, one-year inflation expectations unchanged 3.3 percent five to ten year inflation 3.1 percent up from 3.0 percent now of course we have uh, Joanne Shu coming on uh, Bloomberg uh, Bloomberg terminal if you have Bloomberg I'll be uh, talking to her in just a few minutes about this we'll ask what happened why is it that Americans suddenly turned so pessimistic in the month of June well, you think about psychology, you know, the, those feelings could start to inform their behavior. And we had this conversation yesterday. When does bad news become bad news? When should we start worrying about a growth rollover? Does this slightly, slightly get us closer? It might slightly get us closer. What will be interesting to watch is next week's retail sales report. Did Americans pull back their spending in uh, in reaction, you know, in, in line with their uh, sentiment? Do they feel much more pessimistic about things? The other thing is this is, of course, the preliminary index, and we'll get an update on the University of Michigan sentiment index later in the month. Did the American people not sense the change in inflation that the CPI and PPI reports brought about, and will they? by the end of the month. Those are going to be key questions for the Fed.